Hello everybody, my name is Jared and welcome to Jared Gaming. Welcome to a game called Chain to Digid. Chronological haunted anomalous interconnected narrative guide each decision. I think we play the game sort of like this is an anthology or collection of indie horror games that are somewhat connected somehow, but really aren't. It just doesn't really work out that way from my experience. Um, yeah, we'll see what this has in store. We might play one game, we might play multiple games, depends on how long the games are. Well, let's give it a shot. And here we are in, oh my god, which game did we choose? I don't know. Oh, it's burning. It's it's a hellscape outside. I think it's called like Nether Nathan or something like that, I think. Television? I don't think this works anymore. Oh, probably not. Are you a real person or are you a, oh, you're moving. You are real. Your name is Lucy. Mommy, I'm scared. I'm scared too, honey. <laughs> When can we stop hiding? I don't know, darling. I'm sorry. Why does mommy sound like this? Because look at the world we live in. <laughs> can we just leave? No, we cannot. Okay, all right. What have we here? Vinyl! It's Lucy's favorite album. I hope we listen to it again someday. I'm guessing probably not. The world has ended. There's no coming back from that. Oh, shite. Someone's trying to get in. No, 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 no. We're closed. No visitors allowed, please leave. Out there, there's someone knocking on the door. I can't believe it. Maybe it's someone looking for help? Yes, that's definitely it. Maybe it is them. I can open the door, but I can also push this cabinet into the way. Too late. Push the cabinet, push the cabinet. Wait, Lucy? Did they take Lucy? Oh god, they took Lucy. I acted too slowly, apparently. Leave. They took Lucy. Time to see an old friend? What? Huh? Oh, I'm so confused. Now we're in a VHS store? This is so weird. What is this? Hourglass. Hope you can help me. We don't have much time. Lucy's in danger. Go to the back rooms. Not that. Oh, Morpheus. <laughs> well, well, well. Look who's back after all this time. How can I help you, Catherine? He took her. The Antichrist took Lucy. <laughs> oh my god. I don't even want to think what they do to the children. It doesn't matter. I'll get her back. And how do you plan on doing that? If you don't mind me asking, I mean, I can feel your pain, cat, but she's probably already gone. I know, I don't plan on getting her now. What do you mean? If the Antichrist has never existed in the first place, he would never be able to get Lucy. Now I see. Oh, you do? That's why you need my help. You're the only one that can help me. Kronos. Of course you're Kronos. Of course we're good buddies with Kronos. Kronos, the god of time. I'm flattered, Catherine. But my powers are limited even more now. You're bluffing. You know me well. <laughs> the Antichrist is too powerful to go against like this. And I don't see what I win in all this. You owe me your life, Kronos. You're right. Tell me your plan. I want to make sure he's never bored. I see. You know, there was a lot of rituals in the past so he could come to power today, right? Yes. I want to stop them. <laughs> Kitty with three eyes. You'll have to, each one of them, if you want all this to really work. I can see various points in time which helped him climb to power, but I can't find the conjuration. It doesn't matter. I said I'll stop them all. I know, but you'll have to stop but you'll have to start by the conjuration ritual. Okay, can we move things along here? And how can I discover which one was the conjuration one? I guess you won't. I have two possible dates and places. You'll have to choose between them. Show them to me. Here they are. Okay, the first one is Wyoming, 1968. The second one is Kyoto in 1986. Should I go for the first one? Not exactly, if it's not the conjuration, you will just something, and time is the most precious thing you have right now. Okay, I think I'm ready to choose. Alright, but first, if you need my help while you're in the past, use the hourglass. So, what's it gonna be? 
I mean, we gotta go with Wyoming. I wanna do a Western. How do I even choose? Okay, um, let's go to Wyoming. Oh, I see, it's the chain thing. It's the bit, <laughs> it's coming to pass. Now we're going to go play another game made by a different developer that's set in a Western. Interesting. It's so little. Shush, do not shush me. It's okay. You're safe now, my child. I won't let it, oh, it's Lucy. There are fates worse than death. Oh, it's Kronos? What are you doing here, you bastard? Or is it someone else? It looks like Kronos. I didn't expect to see the face of such a dear friend so soon. Did I misinterpret the chain? You've made no mistake, Damien. It's the Antichrist. Something unexpected has occurred. Unexpected? <laughs> I've never known the god of time to be surprised. It's Catherine. I can only speculate the cause, but the decisions. Normally grains of sand jumped. Is this, this is Lucy. It looks like a doll or a burn victim. I've mysteriously become boulders curving new streams. She's become unbound. Unbound? Interesting. She may be the key to ending it. Please, Kronos, bring her to me. About that, <laughs> I wasn't the only one who noticed. Oh, here we are in the old west. We can look outside, so this is Wyoming. It doesn't look like there's anything for miles. Yep, that sounds like Wyoming, except for the Devil's Tower. It's pretty much like that. Look at candles, smells like candle. <laughs> okay, great. That's a pretty nice jacket. And a bed, this bed smells musty. <laughs> Nothing in the nightstand. It's pitch black. There has to be some light here somewhere. I do. You mean the candle? Like, use the candle. This will work. Just need something to light it with. Um, can we leave? Chrono spawned me here for a reason. I should explore this place before blindly heading out. Okay, I need to. Ah, been a while since I have end the co what? <laughs> this sentence is something else. How do I? Okay, how do I light the candle? It's pitch black. That's a, yes, spawn, what, spawn? How do I light the candle? Do I use the thing here? The hourglass, I thought this was one of Kronos' glasses, but I can't seem to activate it. Guess it's just a normal hourglass. Well, great, we're stuck here forever. How do I light the freaking candle? There's some matches in the pocket. Mine now, well, they weren't there when I looked before. There we go, oh, good, 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 good. Where are we going, into the basement? Is there an, oh, there's an altar. Let's check uh, around real quick. Okay, okay. What have we here? A journal. Isaiah, March 3rd, 1968. It's only gotten worse. This constant noise. A thousand voices talking all at once. It's deafening. I can barely hear myself think anymore. All I have left is prayer. April 16th, 1968. Just when I thought I couldn't take any more, my prayers were answered. I still hear their voices, when it's no longer just noise. They began speaking as one. August 22nd, 1968. I have a hard time telling what are my thoughts and what are theirs. I've been compelled to dig. I started a hole behind my altar. That's where the voices were strongest. September 12th, 1968. They want me to make an angel. They can't until I sacrifice my sight. Oh, those are eyeballs. That's what we're seeing there. Thought they were little flowers. Okay, do I have to rip out my own eyes? Okie dokie, just dead to touch the eyeballs. Great. Into the flesh canal. I don't think that's what this is, but it kind of looks like it. The voices were coming from the deep, were they? That's never a good sign. Catherine, someone's talking to me. Kronos has deceived you, but fear not. For I watch over thee. What? Oh, my head. <laughs> There's a voice in my head. Who's there? Show yourself. Come forth, my child. Life. Oh, it's the voices. The creek and thus far drifted blindly. And I am the water on which you float. The ocean where all things end and the rains that replenish. Enough with the metaphors. I am the mother of all creation. Though you may know me better as God. Oh, this is God, huh? Don't look like any God I know. Whatever happened to being created in your own image? A selfish lie humanity tells itself to obfuscate their insignificance. So we're just ants to you. Atoms to the cosmos would be more accurate. 
What does the cosmos want with an atom? Damien is a monument of hubris. Believing his power ordains him the right to hoard souls. So long as he is allowed to exist, life is destined to perish. Tell me something I don't know. You're wasting my time. I need to stop the conjuration ritual. Have the pieces not clicked for you? There is no conjuration ritual. Kronos sent you back in time as a mercy killing, hoping you'd run out the clock. What? No. He owed me one. As he owed me. My treacherous disciple has a habit of betrayal. Only interested in his own benefit. There is still hope. I will send you to the moment Damien is most vulnerable. And with this, you will smite him down. And anyone else who dares try and stop you. Is that a, what is that? Is it a gun? Did God just give me a gun? And <laughs> what do you get out of all this? A thorn removed from my paw. Should you seek my guidance, you will find me where the seeds of faith have been planted. That's rather cryptic. Go forth. <laughs> My angel of death. This is you. You're God. You're just a tentacles and eyes. Blue. Kronos' stream is always green. Well, clearly we're not in Kronos. Uh oh. Hey, bud. Speak of the devil, Catherine. My attempts to keep you off the board have only promoted you to being the most important piece. You have my deepest apologies. I don't need your apologies. I need you to get out of my way. You attempt to stop me again. Damien will not be the only casualty. <laughs> there is much you do not know. Allow me to take you off for the love of God. Damien will explain. Oh, Damien's going to explain to me? The Antichrist is going to explain to me? You'd see me face the Antichrist at the height of his power? I need you to trust me, Catherine. I don't know what lies that thing spun. Is it a lie that you sent me on a wild goose chase? Hmm, things are different now. You have been gifted a power that can end this conflict, which I adamantly intend on doing. Now move or I'll blow you away, Kronos, with a god gun. Catherine, don't be so rash. I implore you to reconsider. Do I shoot this Morpheus looking ass? Or do I let him take me to Damien? Oh gosh. Oh, do we shoot him or do we spare him? Let's spare him for now. Oh, it says, it says a good faith. Let's spare him for now and see where this takes us, shall we? You live this time, fool. Good faith. Who's this South Park look of Mother Effer? It's Damien. I see Kronos was successful in retrieving you. Welcome, Catherine. Lucy, where's Lucy? What have you done with my daughter? Hmm. I think you know the answer to that already. You bastard. Huh? My gun, where is it? Forgive me, but we had to hide that new toy of yours in order for this conversation to go smoothly. I like how the bottom of the screen is cut off for some reason. Have no fear, you will have it back once we have finished talking. And what is it you're so desperate to discuss? Tell me, Catherine, what do you think happens when you die? We go to heaven, nothing. Nothing happens, we die and that's that. If only that were the truth. An eternal rest, long and peaceful, of fitting into a life of torment. Such niceties are sadly not offered to your kind in the end. The truth of the matter is fear far more grim and unkind. Moments after the passing of a human life, God sends an angel to collect the soul. The soul is not ferried to a higher plane of existence to enjoy paradise, neither is it laid to rest it is harvested. What God intends to do with these souls is unknown to us currently. <laughs> Are we going to war with God now? But we do know that once the harvest is complete, not a sliver of the person that was remains. The process is long and it is very painful, the essence completely drained and their mind numbed, and yet the soul continues to live. Oblivion is not even afforded those unfortunate many. They are painfully uncon they are painfully conscious and suffering even now. That is why I have begun collecting souls of my own. I can spare what is left of humanity from this righteous torture, but as I have done for Lucy. Bullshit, you're a murderer. 
I know you would be difficult to convince. Tell me, when you met with God, did they seem like the kind of benevolent beings described in scriptures? Did it seem like they cared for humans? No, they did not. They called us atoms to the cosmos. I thought so. Could such a god truly invite humans to live with them in the paradise after their demise? I doubt that. Ooh. Oh, hey, Kronos. <laughs> but perhaps you need further convincing. Ah, Kronos, perfect timing. Catherine here is still in need of some encouragement. Did you bring the tape? You don't watch a VHS tape with Kronos and the Antichrist right now? It's right here. Excellent. Consider this a show of good faith. Kronos always told you he was unable to send you back to his moment. But that may have been a white lie. Forgive me, I thought it would be better if you didn't. With this tape, you can change what happens that day. And if you can't, at least you'll get to see an angel at work. Oh gosh, it's the Matrix. <laughs> Best of luck, Catherine. I hope you don't regret this. Oh God. Where am I going? <laughs> what is happening? Where am I? I'm back. Oh, hey. You, uh, Ezra. What are you doing here? I thought you said you were going to stay home and look after Lou. Oh, boy. These, all these guys look like they're from South Park. E Ezra, is that really you? What? Of course it's me, sweetie. Damn, am I that dirty already? What's a, what's gotten into you, cat? You look so pale. Is Lucy all right? She's fine, are you done? Ah, <laughs> uh, she's fine. Lucy's safe at home. I was concerned about you as all. Oh, thank God, you look like you'd seen a ghost. I was worried. If you're that scared, something might happen to me, though. Maybe it's best if we work together today. We'll be finished in no time, and then we can head back home. Does that sound good? Yeah, let's get this done quick. Okay, good. I'll check out this area. You can look around. That'd be great help. Oh, I will, Ezra. Inspect the hydro flask. Give me, give me that thing. I can't pick it up. <laughs> Never mind. Backpack. Inspect backpack. Hmm, what's this? Could be something good in here. Cat behind you. Oh, something done knocked me clean off my feet. <laughs> Well, a cold test. Oh, God. Well, 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 what are we here? Looks like a couple of nobodies. Please let us go. We're no threat to you. Maybe not you, but her, however. Now, just what are you doing with an artifact? Like, what do you mean? The hydro flask? Oh, wait, you got my god gun. How are you even able to help hold my, my god gun? Stop this. Let Ezra go. He's got nothing to do with this. I can tell you everything if you just let him go. Sorry, no can do. His soul is still valuable. Look around you. It's the end of the world. God is purging this world in preparation for the next. The only thing left is to collect the souls of the living. If you have any dignity left, you'll give them up freely. This isn't good. Ezra, is this how you died? Save him this time, but I can't let these two take that gun. Should I save Ezra and get out of here? Or risk it all to get the gun back? I mean, we gotta get the gun back, right? Sorry, Ezra. I need that gun. Weight of Generations. It just keeps going to different games. It's kind of... I kind of like how this is set up. Oh, jeez. Give me that gun, you son of a bitch. Press any button to grab the weapon. Give me that gun. Gimme. Gimme. Mine now, bitch. You... Oh, Ezra. Why couldn't we shoot the other guy quicker? Why are you putting your gun away? I just killed your partner. Yeah. No. Oh. <laughs> you a demon? You a demon? Oh god, it's really horrible. They're they're oh I can't shoot very fast. I I am sh oh my god. Why do we shoot so slow? This is this is so dumb. What the frick? You it's a semi-automatic! You can shoot it as fast as you can pull the freaking trigger! Not in this world, apparently. Good gun. This is not as fun as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Gotta blow up the barrels, apparently. They don't seem to die. They just kind of fall over. And then they get back up. Okay, I guess we're just running forever. Oh, no, we're not. We come to a dead end. Can't touch me. I'm stuck on the environment. <laughs> I don't understand what I'm supposed to be doing right now. This is really bad. <laughs> I, I don't I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now, and they literally can't be killed. Okay, I guess I'm just supposed to die. Because I can't kill anything. 
Nothing dies. I have the god gun and I can't even kill flaming zombies. Kill me. Kill me! Try harder? What do you mean? They don't die! What? Okay, so you just have to fight for like an eternity before anything happens. Kronos, you bastard. As a result of your use of the legendary weapon on mortals, their potential generations have been wiped out. Total carnage. What is the purpose of this fun? I mean, I didn't know what was going to happen. Two paths lay ahead. Either you head back to your apartment and maybe reach Lucy in time before the kidnapping, or you trust me to know what is best in a situation and jump to a time and place of my choosing by touching this hourglass. Okay, Kronos, let's do it your way. I'll touch your hourglass. Use the hourglass. Let's just do it. Good God. I think I'm going to end the video there, guys. I don't know what the frick is going on. That last tape absolutely sucked, in my opinion. It went on for way too long, didn't seem like we were making any progress, and then suddenly it just ended. Didn't care for it. But as, as a whole, I like the idea of this with the different chains and different directions and your choices going to the other games and whatnot. Here to see what happens next, and we'll, maybe we'll play more. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like and a comment. Let me know what you guys thought of this so far. Do you want to see more, or do you not? <laughs> you can be honest. Tell the truth. If you're new to the channel and you like chains, subscribe to the channel. Maybe like the video, leave a comment below, introduce yourself. As always, thank you so much for watching. You've been awesome. Let's play again soon, and I'll see you in the next video.